Hello everyone, welcome back. It is Monday, my favorite day of the week. Uh, this video started off a bit different than expected. I am currently icing my two fingers because um, I had a small incident this morning when I went horseback riding. Unfortunately, it was caught on camera. So yeah, this slightly has changed the course of my day because I had like a little bit of a plan for what I wanted to do after riding, but I thought I would actually come home and just make sure that my fingers were cleaned off and I wanted to put a little bit of ice on them because they started to get swollen really quickly. Um, I am fine, I'm going to be okay. My fingers and my ASMR hands will survive this mishap. I've learned my lesson and I will no longer be bringing whole apples to horses anymore as a treat. Um, only smaller foods that I can give with a flat hand, okay? Anyways, I thought today I would film a video giving you a little bit of Monday motivation, even though by the time this video goes up, it will no longer be Monday, but you can hopefully apply this to any day of the week. Um, I wanted to show you how I've been staying active and also what a day is like for me when I don't have a super like planned out schedule. Um, I do not have a list today. You guys know I love my list, but today I decided to just kind of wing it and try to get some things done that I needed to get done while also taking time for myself to be active, um, get a little bit of exercise. I also have therapy a little bit later in the day. So a lot of like self-care, self-improvement happening today, and then just some other life things. Um, I actually have plans to go on a walk with my neighbor in the next like five minutes, so I don't really wanna keep her waiting. I'm probably just going to wear the clothes that I wore riding, throw on some walking shoes, and get a little bit more exercise while my day is still getting started. Um, walking is one of my favorite things to do. I also love having someone next door who likes to walk as well. It's very motivating to have like a partner or an exercise buddy so I would highly suggest that if if you have like a friend or a neighbor or someone that you can walk with safely right now uh, We do wear masks and we do take precautions and yeah, my neighbor is like eight months pregnant and she Still is up for a walk every day. It's so amazing and I'm I'm very lucky to have her So basically on. One of us is severely overdressed right now. <laughs> Definitely not me. This is my neighbor. We've been walking like pretty much every day. At least every day for the last two weeks. Yeah, sometimes twice a day. Yeah, twice a day, often. It's good exercise. And uh, if we walk later today, I will probably be wearing the same outfit. <laughs> I got so hungry when we were walking. So I'm just having, ooh. Fruit falls on the floor. Give it a little rinse. Still good. I'm just having a little snack before I take a shower and then I think I'll make lunch. Nick just told me to come to the garage if I wanted a treat. My absolute favorite candy in the whole world. Thank you. 
All right, I have taken a shower, exfoliated my whole body, which always feels really nice, and I'm about to make myself a really quick, easy lunch, and then hop on my Zoom call at three for therapy. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to introduce the sponsor of today's video, which is Native. This is my second video working with Native. They are so amazing, and if you guys have not heard of them, they just released their plastic-free deodorant line this year. I have been using these for the last four months. Um, they are packaged in 100% paperboard that is sustainably sourced and the product is just really, really great. I have like the most sensitive skin in the entire world and even for someone like me who has sensitive skin and has had issues in the past with other natural deodorants, um, this has worked really well for me. They have a lot of different scents on their site. This is my favorite, the Citrus and Herbal Musk. You can see over here, this is my old one, but I wanted to show you guys if you can see it's like all the way pretty much pushed up in there I have about half of an inch left of the stick um, but basically you just push that paper stopper up as you use up the deodorant um, and then I also have the charcoal this one I've been using for the last like month you can see it's like a bit darker in color I don't really know how to describe this scent but it's kind of like a nice spring or fall scent and then I have the coconut and vanilla. This one is great if you prefer something a bit more fruity or perfumey, um, which is typically not my my preference, but they're all pretty light, so nothing is like too overpowering, and I would easily use all of these. I haven't tried this one yet, but currently using these two and using up my old one. I'm going to put one on right now since I just got out of the shower. Because they use this paper applicator, I find it's really helpful to kind of hold it at the top so the deodorant doesn't slip down. So you can see there is no residue. It doesn't feel sticky or greasy. It really doesn't feel like I'm wearing much of anything, but it protects really well against odors and it holds up great even during strenuous exercise. Even when I almost had my hand bitten off this morning by a horse, my armpits were still fresh. If you guys would like to try out the plastic-free deodorants from Native, visit my link in the description box. You can use my code ITSPLITS2 to receive three deodorants of your choice in your scent choices for $29, usually $39, so that's a 25% savings. You will also get free shipping anywhere in the US, and I think it's a really good deal. Uh, let me know if you guys have already tried them, if you plan on trying them, and if you have ordered some, let me know what your favorite scent is in the comment section below. Okay, I have about 20 minutes before I need to be at my session. I am planning on just making a really simple salad. It's something I was craving last night for dinner and I went to the grocery store with Nick and got all of the ingredients, but then uh, when I came home, I was just like too tired and I don't know, my stomach kind of hurt, so I ate something very light for dinner. Um, so I already have like the lettuce washed, prepped, and everything. And I'm just gonna throw in a couple of other fresh ingredients. This is everything that I'm using for my salad. I have some organic romaine that is chopped. Like I said, I prepped this last night, so it was already ready in my refrigerator. And then I cut up an English cucumber, a tomato, and I'm going to throw some of this Parmela Creamery vegan mozzarella on the salad. This is my favorite shredded vegan cheese. It is so tasty. If you guys have not tried it, I would really recommend it. Um, and I will also use some of this Bragg's vinaigrette. Whoa, this is hard to do with one hand. You guys don't know the real struggles of YouTube and filming everything that you're doing. I'm going to add some tomatoes. And yeah, you could add like any protein to this. Finished product. A lot of the good stuff sank to the bottom while I was mixing it, but it looks great. You're always great. I can't take you anymore. You have no more therapy and I am feeling like I need a nap. Oh my gosh. Second walk of the day, walking up a very steep hill, hitting those 
Fitbit goals. <sighs> Again, eight months pregnant and still carrying on. <laughs> Gasping for breath. <laughs> Forever. I just can't live with like 11 months out of the year being ridiculous and hard. Hi, how are you? Hey, how are you? Good, thank you. Veggie Burger, Grilled Cheese, Regular Fry, Animal Fry, 7 out. That's yours. Thank you. You want to be the burger and the animal fry? Thanks. Uh, this one is a Veggie Burger, Animal Fry. Thank you so much. Have a good night. You too. Oh shit, I should have waited. Wait for what? Okay, make sure yours is right. Yeah, it's just a bun with nothing on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see yours. <laughs> just the bun. <laughs> Perfect. I don't know what came over me today, but I have been craving in and out This is proof that I am not healthy all the time. We got the grilled cheese animal style, no meat, fries animal style, and then Angela gave me some of these. I think it's like fun dip, but the European version or the UK version. So this is my dinner, you guys. I'm so excited. I'm about to go put on some TV. As always, let me know if you guys are watching new shows. Let me know if you've seen any good movies lately. Leave it in the comments section below. Mmm. I gotta work, suck it up and give a smirk Smile and even know it hurt and see my boss a fucking jerk They call it a paycheck, it's really disrespect